In this tech demo, I'm investigating using the act of reading a book to drive the narrative forward and change the audio and the scene around you as you read. The way I do that is to use head tracking. So you probably not see on the video, but there's a, a pale green cursor and I can move my head and follow along each line and highlight each line in the book and that can trigger events. And you'll notice that I'm hardly moving my head at all, at all to move this cursor. So the, uh, the movement is actually exaggerated. Now there's no controls to move me around this room. I can't walk around it. Uh, and what I do instead is I'd read certain lines. So for example, I read in this first line, it takes me over to the bookcase. So that means your location in the room is tied to your position in the story. I can use the mouse to put the book into a more comfortable reading position, or I can move the book completely out of the way just so I can look around easier. Now, because it's a VR book, um, we do want people to pay attention to the environment. And one of the ways to do that is to use positional sound. So if I read the first few lines here, that triggers a knock on the door behind me. And posi the positional sound works really well, so it, it will make you look in the right direction to spot something new. And we, we want to create scenes that make the reader feel more immersed in the experience of the book. So an example here is a character has been thrown down a well. So we've got the audio of the drips. And we can look up the well and get a sense of the scale and the feeling of actually being in here. Now, in the next scene, the idea here is that we'd be in a busy restaurant environment. Now that would be very hard to model accurately with realistic looking customers. So what we're doing in this scene is we're just using ambient sound and some mood lighting and just leaving the rest to the uh, reader's imagination. The important point here is that by not trying to do everything, it means that there's no limits to your story. You can do whatever you like and just concentrate on the scenes that work well in VR and add something. You just do those in VR. And here's another example of a scene. So the idea of this one is just to see what you feel like if you're walking along the beach as you're reading. So I'd be interested on your feedback here to see if it does make you feel nauseous to be moving a little bit. So that's just a quick look at the tech demo. Um, you'll find there's two books on the desk. The first is the tech demo we've just skipped through. The second is a short story that uses some of the, uh, the ideas. So please download the demo and uh, do let me know what you think of the concept. Cheers.